In this video, we begin by explaining what an automation system is and how it communicates. While some communication types are straightforward, others require more explanation and will be covered in a video of their own. These include CrestNet, InfoNet EX wireless communication, and the Ethernet standard. We'll demonstrate how to transfer programs and touchscreen projects to processors and user interfaces using the Crestron Toolbox software. We'll also discuss firmware. What is firmware? Why we sometimes need to update it? The benefits of doing so? and how to upload it. At the end of this, you will know how to set up, install, and maintain a Crestron control system. You will have a basic understanding of the various components within a system and how they communicate with each other. This includes Crestron devices that use proprietary protocols, such as CrestNet and Infinet EX, as well as standard protocols such as Ethernet. We'll look at how Ethernet can be used to communicate with products from other manufacturers, as well as other methods like serial and infrared control. Most importantly, by the end of this class, you will have the confidence to hook up your laptop to see the system status and make small changes. Integration and automation. In the business environment, presentation and collaboration technology is increasingly part of how we communicate. Technologies that allow online meetings, document sharing, and collaboration is increasingly used. Sometimes you may need to present from your own device. AV equipment has become as central to the business as other communication infrastructure, such as phone and email. In many cases, if the meeting room AV equipment fails, then the meeting fails. Many consider AV systems and meeting rooms to be business critical. This continuing trend demands reliable devices, sustainable and repeatable AV solutions. An integrated room system for a meeting should include appropriate communications technology for the people in the room, such as displays, and the ability to show content from both fixed presentation devices and the presenter's own laptop or mobile device. The room should also include appropriate communications technology for remote participants, such as video conferencing or Skype for business. An intuitive means to operate the room equipment should be provided. Millions of dollars are lost every year due to setup time of meetings. Most importantly, the room should provide an environment where effective communication is possible and made easy for the meeting participants. With Crestron, you can also control everything in your home, room by room, using our touchscreens and remotes on your favorite smart device. Complete, easy, and worry-free. A good automation system should provide a truly smart home, not just a dumb home filled with smart devices. With the home automation system, there are four main things that you want to achieve. One, you want reliability. Technology is supposed to make your life better and simpler, not more complicated. Two, blend naturally into your home and lifestyle. Really, you just want everything to work, so you don't have to think about it, it's just there. That's what you get with Crestron. Three, you want simplicity. You don't want complex button panels or to have to read a manual just to work out how to turn the television on. You want nice, simple operation. Perhaps a movie button that dims the lights, closes the shades, and switches the TV onto the media server. Four, lastly, you want personalization. If there's one thing you can count on, it's that your life and your needs will change. A Crestron home automation system is infinitely flexible, so it can grow right along with those changing needs. We hope that you will enjoy the following videos, which will get you started with the technical skills you need to start working with Crestron.